everybody it's operation destroy and welcome back to my channel you guys today i'm taking on dr terror and uh yeah not dr terror dr t i gotta get used to saying that because i've been so used to terror so it's dr t or mr t he is a guy so it could be mr t as well so let's jump in where is he at there he is sitting pretty right there dr t stage one and um, I'm gonna go unboosted here, guys, and I'm gonna use my my um, hookah strategy. So let's just jump right in. Um, like I said, in the update, they added these little cool things, these new ones here. It's really cool. Watch what I'm gonna do when I blast it with an artillery. Watch it explode in green goo. Isn't that just epic? That's awesome. That's amazing. I love I love what Supercell does when they do their their um, look. It's even glowing. It's really cool. Um, I love what, what they do with their updates. They really do some really spectacular work. So I'm just going to actually blast those guys and just send a hyper barrage right at the HQ and call it a day here on Dr. T stage one, guys. There we go. Get the, uh, get the fragments and the intel. Why not? There he is. I wonder, is he saying anything different? Not really. Okay. Boom. All right. Dr. Terror stage two, guys. Moving and trucking along just fine. Um... Here is another one of the additions to uh, Dr. Terror. Dr. T, come on up, destroy, say it right. And here we go, let's, there's another green blast. And um, I think maybe, let's see, can we get a uh, hyper barrage to take out Terror Stage 2? It looks like we will. So Stage 2 does go with the bang, and there we go, moving right along. Haven't deployed one troop yet. Let's see how far I can go without deploying one troop. That would be kind of cool, wouldn't it? So here, let's try to do it. Let's just get rid of some of these uh, rocket launchers here with the um, with the barrage and get rid of this sniper tower here. One more here. Get rid of the machine gun that can reach the core. Boom. That little cannon is cute, but he's going. And I think that's pretty good. And then let's just send some critters up to the HQ and let them have a field day as you can hear they also make new noises that cannon can reach but it's okay because our faithful critters will annihilate stage three and there it goes bam and there we go we get a shard i'll take what i can get all right so moving on to stage four we are dealing with a few a shock launcher down there is not going to reach my troops all we got to really do is just get rid of these defenses in here and we should have a pretty another easy takedown hopefully with the critters i got to get rid of that flamethrower for sure because it will be a pest and we'll try to get some of these machine guns taken out because uh we don't want them messing with our troops and um i think those snipers might be in range but let's just give it a shout. I think the critters will actually kill that other sniper tower because he's really low on HP. There he goes. And I'm actually gonna send a, a shock over here to shock those those defenses so they don't get my critters. And we are gonna dance all over Dr. T stage four here with critters. So um, ooh, that machine gun is firing at my critters. It is okay because I think we will take it down. Yes, we will. Stage four, down with critters. And uh, yeah, haven't had to deploy one Zooka or Heavy yet. I will like that, why not? I am running, I was running low on gold to start, but now I'm building back up, which is great. So uh, dancing into stage five, this one looks a little bit more difficult to send critters to, so I think my critter um, run is over. Um, this one here, I'm going to place my troops right where this ice masterpiece is. There's a nice little swath area there where I could plant them. And uh, so yeah, let's jump right in and do the smoky hookah attack, you guys. So um, because the defenses are right on the beach here, I'm gonna actually pre-smoke this beach and uh, send my troops out. And I'm actually gonna flare them right to that flare point. And uh, they should hopefully just huddle all together there in that, that nice, beautiful smoke. And I'm gonna actually smoke them now to the location where I want them to be. And uh, they should make it there safe and sound. And then uh, I'm gonna actually flare back into the smoke. 
I'm actually gonna shock and send some critters out and send them a med kit over my heavies because they're gonna take the brunt of the, the, the force here from those flamethrowers. And uh, boom, there goes Dr. T stage five. I did lose one heavy in the last moment, but that's not too bad. And uh, boom, being stingy on the power stones, aren't we, Dr. T? Come on now. Okay, so we lost a heavy. Let's replenish him and get him back on board. Rest in peace. And we're moving to stage six, guys. This is getting more interesting. Awesome. Um, what I'm gonna do here is uh, trying to think. Let's see, let's see. Um, we got a rocket's gonna fire upon us right away. So what we should do is, um, a lot of the defenses are actually like far enough south that they won't even hit my Zookas when we put them over here. So I'm gonna actually barrage this location here and uh, send an artillery right in the middle. Will I get those? Yeah. Okay, I'm not too worried about the sniper tower hitting my troops because it's only a one-shot defense. So what I gotta do here is I gotta pre-smoke this beach again because uh, I got a bunch of defenses that would love to just take out my uh, troops. So, um, and I forgot about those mines. So it's okay, let's flare them all the way up. Oh, I got a heavy that wants to that wants to play with the uh, with the defenses here. And so I'm gonna send some critters out. I got 30 GBE left. So this is gonna be, yeah, this is kind of a sloppy run. Um, get in that smoke, Zookas. Okay, and so I'm gonna flare this HQ now. I'm actually gonna shock that rocket and the other, well, I don't have enough GBE, but I will throw on a med kit here and um, we should take this HQ out fairly quick before that rocket hurry before that rocket thank you all right that was kind of a sloppy run guys but who cares right we were victorious let me see that crystal dr t boom thank you and uh that time around i lost three heavies and 21 zookas yikes all right let's get that back and proceed to stage seven i like to scout it because it is stage seven um he has a lot of mines planted up in the left corner here because uh, he knows that's where <laughs> I'd probably run and I'm going to. Um, I just need to, ooh, he has, okay, he doesn't have, he doesn't have too much HP, even with the statue. So uh, maybe I should go from the right side, um, but then there's just a lot of weapons, a lot of defenses there. Okay, all right, what do we got here, 20k. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, let's just go. It just there's not many mines on that side. I'm trying to contemplate what's the better run here. Uh, let's just do what I said and we'll go from the left side and see how that pans out. I'm gonna actually do a double barrage here. Um, I want that machine gun and mortar for surely toast. Um, it's not doing too much damage to that mortar. So I'm gonna actually have to artillery and it's gonna cost some artillery, yikes. Okay, and I'm gonna need to do one more for that mortar, yikes. Okay, that's that was not that was not great. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is, <laughs> this is the fun part, um, I need to, I'm gonna have rockets just barreling down on my troops. So I'm gonna see if I can just lay this out in two smokes here. Let's see if I, if I can do this. And then uh, flare them here. I'm gonna actually smoke one more time, and then I'm gonna actually send them way up in the corner now. Oop, my zookas are getting fried. I gotta do. I gotta place some critters to get rid of those those mines up there because I'm gonna lose a lot of zookas if they run over those mines. I have 18 GBE left to do this. Um, I don't know if that's enough. I need to shock the rockets in the back so they don't get my zookas, and because that's the, that's the primary. And, I, and now I, all I have is a, a heal med kit. Guys, this is gonna be, I don't know, we'll see. But we're gonna we're gonna see if my Zookas can withstand this and take out this, we need, we need to, come on Zookas, blast that HQ, come on girls. Boom, we got it you guys. Sloppy, but it was done. And we got stage seven done with an unboosted troop combination of, ooh, and there's two crystals. Thank you, thank you Dr. T for giving me those two crystals there. I will, I appreciate those that, to the very fullest of my heart, I do. I lost 43 precious Zookas there, you guys, but we took care of him and he's toast. There is Commander John giving me the salute. Thank you, sir. 
And that's Dr. T, guys. Finished, unboosted with the uh, hookah strategy. So there we go, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know how you did on Dr. T, Dr. T and how, uh, how uh, I don't know. Let me know how you did. And uh, give me a thumbs up, you guys, if you like this video. And uh, if you have any other suggestions, you guys, if you want me to do anything, um, any challenges or what have you, let me know in the comments below. Um, are there any other games that you want me to try to put on my channel? Let me know, please. I do play Bloons TD Battles. Um, I do have Clash of Clans as well. Um, I don't play it as much, but I actually am up there on level. I have Town Hall 11. I have all the new stuff. Um, so if you want me to show some Clash, let me know, guys, in the comments below, and I'd be more than happy to. Other than then, guys, have a great rest of the day, night, or afternoon, and I will talk to you again soon. Bye-bye.